Hello everybody, Burnt Out Guy here, and welcome back. Alright, so we're back for another wonderful episode of World of Tanks. I am playing myself a tier 9 battle. Um, it didn't end all that great, but let me just tell you, I still got, got something out of area. it, so that's Take all that really matters. So we're here on steps, doing the sandstorm. Um, this one is actually kind of fun to play, uh, especially now that we have like you know weather and stuff like that. It does really change a little bit of the the way the game mechanics work. Uh, apparently, your camouflage is supposed to you know help you camouflage better, and you lose sight of people a lot faster, and all that garbage, right? So, me being in a tier nine battle uh, with my little tier seven, I decide to uh, always check to see where everybody's going. Um, I know I'm not going to be able to do like retarded amount of damage in this, but I should be able to do pretty decently. Um, like, I don't, I do think I threw off a few APCR, if I'm not mistaken, but, um, I don't Focus recall using here. too many of them anyways, and I still did some decent penetrations, but that's okay. Um, yeah, so it's gonna be a little while before we actually see a little bit of action here, because apparently most of their crew, they went up, and us well we managed to get almost right into their base pretty much well maybe just a little bit before before uh, the match ended but yeah um i didn't this weekend we played a lot like with the guys and i have like so many videos to go through so it's gonna be like a little while before i can you know kind of catch up on my uploading and all that crap so like i spent so much time grinding and hitting some Focus money and all location. that crap while you know like Ah, I'm getting needed for the French line. So, yeah, that French line is pretty brutal. But uh, as you can see, we're pretty much almost boy, all the way down the side here, and we haven't really seen much. Uh, action is coming up pretty soon. Uh, once I pretty much will get up where these guys are here. Um, not far from where the IS-3 is now, I think. Yeah, I think that's where all the action starts. I don't really like uh, want to get involved with most of the action that's up there right now because there's a lot of big tanks up there that could just make mincemeat of me and I don't want to uh, get involved in that so I'm going to try to uh, just sneak off and see what I can get from like the kind of the sniper aspect of it all and you know this tank is really good like there is a lot of bouncy aspects about it which is kind of fun you know like I, I have had some matches where they just bounce the shit out of me, but I am on tier 9s, and I know these guys, they're probably, probably good, so I just kind of like, you know, follow these guys back here. Now, right here, this is where we're going to start seeing some action. Um, we're going to have a turquoise coming up here. I used to have one of those tanks. I love that tank. It was fucking awesome, but you can't, uh, you can't get out there like this guy's doing. Now, I do miss two shots, they just fly right over top of them, there's shot number one. Shot number two is about to come up, and that's just going to fly over top of them as well, and then that kind of pisses me off on my eyes, coming on the open character. Now I do think I load up an APCR after the third shot, and I bounce them, <laughs> which totally aggravates me. Like, there's one shot bounce, and I'm like, ah, oh, why, am I, how am I bouncing this guy? It's because I'm too fucking far. You know, if I was just, like, maybe a little bit closer, I probably would have, you know, probably wouldn't have really hit him, you know? So he does hit me anyways, and him or somebody else, one of the two, but I do decide to come up here and check this shit out, a driving shot. <laughs> now, I don't get those too bloody often, but it's like that. You made me waste three shots in you. Well, here we go. There's the, the fourth one. That was the turn, baby. That one got the kill. <clears throat> so as we keep going around here, I'm like I said, I'm just trying to stay out of people's sight because I just don't want to get like nailed right. I don't want to try to stay alive as long as possible. <laughs> and I thought I could get through here, but apparently I was completely mistaken. I cannot fit my fat tank through there. So that's okay. Um, I do think I take a couple shots, yeah I do take two shots on him and I do get two decent penetration shots so it does make it worthwhile, you know. I still haven't switched over to APCR yet so that's good, I'm glad uh, I haven't used any. I thought I did use a few in this battle but I guess I, I might not have, but 
And then here we go for the second shot. Okay, I nailed him two really good shots and somebody else finished them off, so. Ah, I did all the work there. All the work. <laughs> That's okay, I don't care. Uh, I think that looks really trippy. Those lights on there and all that. I think that looks really cool. That tripped me out at first. I was going around the corner and I was like, oh my god, is that a tank? I'm like, tanks don't have fucking lights, you know? Like, anyways, whatever. So. Here this guy is going for the artillery and boom. Oh, and that's when I noticed that there was two of them over there. I'm like, alright. So it was the other guy that pot shot at him and was protecting that guy. So here's how we gotta play this. I decided to go for the arcs. I think I'm the closest. I'm like really the only one that's around there. So I decided to go for that. I'm like, fuck it. If I'm gonna leave this battle, I'm leaving this battle with a few kills. So here's the first one. Got one. Now, like I said, I know that other one is up there, so I just wait for my thing to load up a little bit more. That way, I can get around the corner and shoot him before he shoots me. But I don't know. For some reason, I just like brain farted and lagged, and I was like, "Oh, he shot me!" Oh yeah, here, bang! <laughs> so as you can see, I'm just like, "Fuck, is he really up there? Like, is he just waiting for me?" So I know he's waiting for me. I know he is. And then. There it is. See, I should have shot, but it wouldn't have mattered. Even if I would have shot first or shot second, it was all good. And then boom, we collide. Now, I get a game clip recorded, and I'm like, seriously? What the fuck was that for? You know? And I, I, I realize in here that, you know, I did get two badges. One was eye for an eye, and the other one was common cause. Which is pretty freaking awesome. I was like, alright, well, you know, 35,000 bucks, 1,000 experience, 1,700 damage, 3 kills, 5 pins. You know, I didn't do much rest other than that, but you know, I did walk away with, you know, eye for an eye and kamikaze. <laughs> so it was kind of funny anyways, but that's it everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video and we'll see you next time.